going on people so before this video starts i just want to say one thing before i get abused in the comment section and the comments i'm probably going to get are where have you been why have you not uploaded why have you only just uploaded the video after this amount of time well we've been planning big yeah so we, we've been planning basically so long story short we've been planning and we just want to let you guys know we ain't gone nowhere and uh we're gonna upload this video for you so we've put together a top 10 most painful injuries that we've had on this channel fair warning ahead this contains broken bones uh concussions and blood so yeah enjoy all right so coming in at number 10 i would say was the extreme egg challenge when you got these eggs thrown at you it didn't just sting really bad it would cut you as well so where the shell would break it would cut and leave grazes and slices in you i thought it's only an egg what possibly could an egg do to me that that really hurt it's cut already i think it's because i did it so hard Oh my god, look at that! Look at that! Go! Oh, right on the ribs! <laughs> I decided to prank Pete. I emptied a whole pot of shampoo and I filled the whole bowl, and I mean the whole bowl, with deep heat. If you guys have used deep heat, you'll know this stuff is extremely. And I'm mean extremely hot, like this stuff burns. This stuff kills. Like, we've done stuff on this channel with deep heat before, but oh, I'd say I did talk to Pete after that, and he said the pain was like an 8 out of 10, so <laughs> that must have killed. Anyway, we're going to empty this, and then once we've emptied it, we're going to fill it with deep heat. Oh my god, this is going to be so bad. Pain relief, he's going to be in pain. Oh, if anything, after this. Obviously, this was a trending challenge at the time. Basically, we got a Nerf gun and we put thumbtacks on the top of the bullets and we fired it at each other. Pete fired it at me and it got stuck in my head. I pulled the bullet and the pin was still stuck in my head. So I had to pull the thumbtack out of my head. Like my skull obviously stopped it going in further. But that hurt pretty damn bad. Oh! Yeah, I'm dropped three more blood. I'm bleeding again. My head's completely gone. Look at that. It's literally split open. Three, two, two one. one. Ah! I'm done. I'm done with the video. Ah! Ah! Done. The slip and slide video. Now, <laughs> this video was really fun to film. The reason it is on this list is because. Let's say this is the bottom of my spine. I lifted my legs up and slid down the hallway. Uh, as I've come sliding down the hallway, I've bashed into the door with the bottom of my spine, which hurt pretty damn bad. And Pete also slipped over and banged the back of his head. So the pain, that was pretty bad. Did you break in the bottom of your spine? It's not a recommended one to do at home. <laughs> cactus video there was a video that we watched and it had a cannon so we made a gas cannon and we tried it with tennis balls at first and don't get me wrong that really hurt and we decided to use cactuses and we put a cactus into this gas cannon and the pain of it being fired at you and hitting you hurt enough that pain yeah that's not a recommended one to do either <laughs> Okay, we're going to get this fresh cactus and we're going to put it in. Oh, 
Oh, mate. I need to pull it off, it's not going in. Ow! <laughs> this is an interesting one because obviously we love pranking each other here on this channel and we literally abuse each other at times. Mark and Steve decided to prank me by telling me that there's a Guinness World Record that I'm going to break. Because they told me that this Guinness World Record was to see how many times I could put my finger in a mousetrap. And if I did it a certain amount of times, I'd break this Guinness World Record. It was like 20 something times, I believe, like 27 something times. And that pain hurt freaking bad. <laughs> We've got a prank on Malcolm. So uh, it involves mouse traps, yeah. and we're going to ask him to do 25 mouse traps uh, on his hand. And if he does that, he's beating the Guinness World Record, which isn't a record. No. Oh! <laughs> oh! Nine. <laughs> ten. Eleven. <laughs> it's so right, so we decided to do a cling film wall. I decided to get on a bike and right into it. As I did, the bike handle, bearing in mind this is a metal bike handle, it went straight into my knee. So it went bang into my knee. That pain was unbearable for like 10 something minutes. I was literally like, just, oh, my knee, my knee, my knee. Everyone's like, oh, what's up, what's up? I was like, I think I broke my knee. So yeah, that pain was bad. I'm never doing that again. This one was extremely dangerous, so we decided to make a homemade helmet and then use a catapult to test it. And basically, I think it was a, um, a frozen Brussels sprout. Mark, obviously, being a, a big lad and a strong lad, he's obviously fired the catapult and he's put this frozen Brussels sprout or whatever it was in the catapult. And he's fired it at my helmet and it's hit me right in the back of the head, straight through the helmet. Bashed me straight in the back of the head. So a frozen Brussels sprout from a catapult to the back of the head. That pain was actually seriously bad and I felt dizzy after doing that. So yeah, that was quite a bad pain. Three. to we want to do like a jump rope kind of video we made this like wooden jump thing so it would spin round and you could jump over it i spun it round and it hit my shin so hard it literally nearly broke my shin and i got two blood clots in my leg from it so it basically nearly broke my shin and i got two blood clots uh, blood clots from it and the pain <sighs> I'd say the pain was at least an 8 out of 10. That really hurt. I think I've just broke my knee. I think I've broke my shin. No, don't come here. Oh. No, you see the massive lump in my knee? Look, there's a massive lump in my knee. Yep. Oh, I think I broke my shin. This pain lasted for four days straight. I could not sleep, I could not move about without being in pain, and it is the worst, most excruciating pain I have ever felt on this channel. So we decided to fill up a swimming pool with stinging nettles. This pain was a 10 out of 10, and I would never, ever do that again. You are not gonna want to fall into that. Oh. Ah, ah, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god, he's going. 